with powerful tech becoming more portable and portable tech becoming more powerful, many people are moving their workflows over to the iPad exclusively. Now the question is, is there a powerful enough DAW replacement out there in the app world? That is what we're gonna be getting into in this video. What is up people, I'm Jarrell, your music technologist, here to help you master the tech you need to make music freely. I make weekly tip and tutorial videos as well as product reviews on all things music production. If you enjoy that kind of content, go ahead and hit that like button, subscribe, and don't forget to click the bell so you can be the first to catch the next one. So why did I choose Beatmaker 3? You know, I've been using FL Studio for 10 plus years I've got that much time invested in it and choosing a different DAW is a big deal for me. I hate relearning software. I tried FL Mobile on the iPad and I just wasn't feeling it um, for a number of reasons, but I found that Beatmaker 3 just checked all the boxes that I needed and could handle the heavy lifting that most producers need. Something really important to consider um, in the iPad world is software affordability and it is great. Instead of paying multiple hundred dollars and even into the thousands for DAWs and for plugins, VSTs and everything, in the iPad ecosystem you're paying for apps that can range from anywhere from free to around $40 like at the most. So you can get some really good sounds for a really good price. Um, right now in the App Store, Beatmaker 3 goes for $26.99. Yes. And for the majority of the plugins and sounds I've gotten through the App Store, it's, it's always been like around five to seven bucks. So another thing you might be thinking about is your gear, your I.O., like the things you plug in. Um, can you do things like that on iPad? Of course you can. Um, if you have a good enough USB-C hub, everything is pretty much plug and play. I run so many things through my USB hub. I run my uh, MIDI keyboard, this full-size 88 keyboard right here, 88 key keyboard. Um, and I run my Bluetooth MIDI keyboard, I run, I run my M-Audio interface, my studio microphone, uh, my speakers, uh, just a ton of peripherals, and I have had no problems. And you know, maybe I'll do a setup tour soon just to give you guys um, a look at what my setup looks like, but everything has been super nice for plugging in straight into the iPad. Now I know for most producers, it boils down to interface. Is the program intuitive to use? To me, it's definite yes. Um, of course, with any program, there's a learning curve. For me, the learning curve uh, was actually very minimal for Beatmaker 3. And again, I come from FL Studio background, but for most people that have used a DAW before, it's gonna be a piece of cake for you to get used to it. Um, what I like the most is that everything is mapped out perfectly for touch input and for Apple Pencil input. It, it just makes sense. From pinch to zoom within patterns and the playlist to granular controls for adjusting faders, everything just works like it should. The best part for me is having every sound bank mapped to a playable sample pad with no delay. These pads have so many controls that add creative ways to play in your sounds. Organization in Beatmaker 3 is easy and well laid out. Sessions, samples, banks, and plugins are well organized in the top left hamburger menu, and exporting is a piece of cake. Everything is honestly just exactly where you would expect it to be, and navigating the program feels intuitive. So whether you're an experienced music producer looking for a more portable workflow solution, or you're a beginner looking for their first DAW, I think Beatmaker 3 on the iPad is a solid program for you. No, this video is not sponsored. I did not get any money for this. I just believe in the program and I use it every day for my music production. So if you're looking for some tips on how to get started on Beatmaker 3, making your first beat, make sure that you're subscribed and you have that notification bell on because that video is coming soon. To all my creatives, go out there and make something dope and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.